Hey guys, it's Lucas and in this video I'm gonna be going over how you can set up your proxy list on AI Oba as well as how you can allocate different proxy lists to different tasks for releases. Uh, so to begin with, to create your proxy list, you first want to go to the proxies tab and then you want to click on add new. And once you're here, you have two options. You have the list name and the proxy tab itself. The list name can just pretty much be any name that will allow you to remember uh, what the list exactly is. So for example, let's say I want to set up two types of lists, one for you know foot sites and another one for Shopify. So I'm going to first begin with foot sites proxies. So I'm just going to name this foot sites proxies. And I'm going to go over here and get my list of proxies. Now, if you purchase, the, for example, proxies like A and B proxies, this is the sort of format that you will get. So I'm going to take these and I'm going to paste them over here and I'm going to click save. And so now I have five proxies on my foot sites proxies list. And we also said that we wanted to create a Shopify proxy list. So I'm going to go on here as well. Shopify proxies. And I'm going to take the remainder of these proxies and add them here. Click save. Now you have the proxy lists pretty much uh, made. So what you could do now is let's say you want to delete all your proxies list. All you got to do is just kind of click on delete all. Uh, you could also delete individual proxy lists as well. If you want to edit your proxy list, you can go ahead and click on this and switch the proxies. Uh, favoriting the proxy list that will be pretty much relevant when you want to create uh, quick tasks and that will be explained in a different video and so pretty much when you create a quick task you're gonna want to uh, favorite at least one proxy list so that it could be used in the quick task and you also have this button over here the buy proxies pretty much you click on it and it will send you to a website where you can purchase proxies of course you don't have to purchase proxies only from the AMB site. There are many other providers that we are partnered with on the AMB Discord or the AIO Bot Discord, and you can pretty much check them out, compare different plans, and see what works for you. Now, to go to the next thing that we wanted to discuss, which is pretty much how do you allocate different proxy lists to different tasks, and that's actually quite simple. So we go to the task list, and we're gonna want to create, let's say, a foot sites task. So I'm not going to explain how to set up tasks, that will also be explained in a different video, but to explain the proxies list, as you can see here, at, right now my task has no proxy list allocated to it. But when I click on it, now I'm allowed to pick different proxy lists. So I can pick foot sites proxies, fill in all my information, and that's pretty much how you know you will have your proxy list used for the foot sites task. Uh, of course, let's say you didn't want to use any proxies on your proxies list, then you can just pretty much click no proxy. And what that does is it will use your local IP to actually cop the item. Of course, you don't want to do that on multiple tasks. You kind of want to, if you want to use your local IP, you usually want to do that on just very few tasks, like one, two, you know, maybe three tasks. Uh, you could go more, but you know, the more tasks you start running on your local IP, the riskier it becomes. And the whole point of using proxies to begin with is, you know, to, to avoid getting your main local IP banned. And I can also go ahead and, you know, I can go to Shopify and that's kind of pretty much the same thing as well. If I'm going on DL DTLR, I could also go here and this time I can select my Shopify's proxy list, you know. So that's pretty much just the whole concept of allocating your proxy list. And, you know, I mean, that's pretty much the whole concept of just pretty much setting up your proxy list anyways. So I uh, hope you found this video uh, insightful and on to the next one.